This set of slides is about elasticity and this specific presentation will explain price elasticity of demand and how this is calculated. So price elasticity of demand is the percentage change in the quantity demanded if the price of the product changes by 1%. So it ch tells us if the price change a little bit, how much will the quantity you demand change? We're going to calculate the elasticity coefficient. That is the ratio of the percentage change in the quantity demanded to the percentage change in the price. Using this, we are able to determine how consumers react to a change in price of a product. So the formula to calculate price and elasticity of demand is the percentage change in the quantity demanded of a product divided by the percentage change in the price of the product. So let's take another look at the formula. To simplify the calculation, we can break the formula into bits. We first have to calculate the percentage change in the quantity demanded. Then we have to calculate the percentage change in the price of the product. And then we combine these two to determine the price elasticity of demand. Let's look how to calculate price elasticity of demand by considering Jerry, a bread baker in Pretoria. Jerry has been struggling to sell all the bread he made before the end of the day. So he was consequently forced to decrease the price he is willing to accept for his bread. He has decreased the price from 15 rand to 10 rand, and now that it's cheaper, more people want to buy his bread. The quantity of bread loaves demanded has now increased from 8 to 10. So here we summarize it. The price was 15 rand, now he has decreased it to 10 rand. At the price of 15 rand, he sold 8 loaves, and at the pr lower price of 10 rand, he now sold 10 loaves. If we now want to calculate price elasticity, step 1 is to calculate the percentage change in quantity demanded. So we take the new quantity of 10 minus the old quantity, 8, divided by the old quantity of 8 times 100. So it's 10 minus 8 divided by 8 times 100. 10 minus 8 is 2 divided by 8 times 100 gives us 25%. So step 2 is to calculate the percentage change in the price of the product. So it's the new price minus the old price divided by the old price times 100. So the new price is 10 minus 15 divided by 15 times 100. Note that the new price is lower than the original price as there is a decrease in the price which is indicated by a negative number. So 10 minus 15 gives you minus 5 divided by the original price of 15 times 100 and that gives us minus 33%. Now we combine the two in step 3, put the values into the elasticity formula. So it's the percentage change in quantity demanded divided by the percentage change in the price percentage change in the quantity was 25%, but the percentage change in the price of the product was minus 33%. So the price elasticity of demand is equal to 25 divided by 33, which is minus 0 0.78. Because we are looking at price elasticity, we can ignore the minus sign and we only consider the absolute value 
So we can say that the price elasticity of demand is equal to 0 0.78.